Hello and welcome to So Fresh Sophia. Today we're going to be making sweet potato tahini asada jars. You can make like six of them in like 20 minutes. It's amazing. So let's go ahead and get started. The first thing you're going to do is wash your sweet potatoes and then just take a fork and poke holes in them. Once that is done, we are just going to set these in the oven for five to seven minutes. All right, and then we are going to do our quinoa. So go ahead and put one cup of quinoa. Then we added two cups of water. And then we're gonna add in a little bit of oil. And then just add on the top. This is a rice cooker. Um, you can use a saucepan, but this is much easier. I'll put the link in the description to this product. And for your maple tahini dressing, which is absolutely delicious, you're gonna add in two tablespoons of tahini, four tablespoons of oil, one tablespoon of maple syrup, one tablespoon of lemon juice. Mix this up. I find that it's a little thick for dressing, so you're gonna add about two tablespoons of water, at least at first, and just kind of mix it until it gets to the right consistency just adding more water along the way. At the end, you'll want your consistency to kind of be not watery, but thin. And then we're gonna chop up three quarters cup of these cute little cherry tomatoes. And I would just cut them in half. Take your onion, we are gonna cut about six tablespoons of thinly sliced onion. Then we're gonna go ahead and set these aside and cut our sweet potatoes next. Now we are ready for the fun part, stacking all the goodies. First thing we're gonna do to start off this party is add two tablespoons of dressing to each mason jar. And next we are going to add in our quinoa. Add about two thirds cup per mason jar. Then add in your onions and go ahead and add in your tomatoes next is my personal favorite part the sweet potatoes so go ahead and add in about a quarter of a cup each mason jar and now comes the lettuce the key to these mason jars is to make them airtight so that they last you the whole week so whenever it looks like there's not any more room to put more lettuce just keep pushing it in there. You can go ahead and add your toppings. Today we are doing cranberries and pumpkin seeds. And then whenever you want to take your sauna jar to school or work, you can just bring a paper plate or get one there and just dump it out and your salad will be ready. I hope you enjoy this recipe, try it out, and I will see you next time. And don't forget, 